Okay, so let's begin. To install the plugin, go to plugins, add new, upload plugin, choose file, navigate to the zip file, click install now. The install should take a while because the plugin is pretty big. But we have patience. Okay, finally the plugin activate uh, installed, click activate and go to plugin settings. Here we have the plugin control panel. We must include our YouTube API key. Go here to get one. Create a project get it a name creating project wait until the project is created go to youtube data api click enable Click on create credentials, data API, web browser, determine which settings will be calling from the web browser, public data, what credentials do I need to, and copy this key, and insert it, in save settings. Uh, the OAuth key is not necessary if you want to post to uh, WordPress only from YouTube. This is necessary for posting from YouTube to WordPress and these two are necessary for posting from WordPress to YouTube. If you want only from YouTube to WordPress, this is enough. Now go to YouTube to posts and here we can configure our first rule. Uh, let's say first I'll show you my blog. It is empty. Now let's say I search YouTube for uh, Audi. Okay, these are the settings, advanced settings. I leave them at their default value. But take a look at them, pause the video if you want. Also here. Okay. Save changes. And run the rule. Now our rule is running, the posts are created, the rule running took very few time, very less time, and here are our created posts. Let's look at one. The full description of the video and the videos itself. This is the new Audi A5, and it's essentially an A4, only in a slightly snazzier jacket to help make it stand out and become more, even at speed. Okay. The advanced settings include, you can modify the title of the post <coughs> the content of the post with these short codes you can include these short codes here video event type completed live upcoming you can select the channel id the location where the video was posted resource type show or any 
save search you can turn it off or make it more strict you can search in a region or a country you can uh, search for only videos with closed caption or none you can search for high definition or standard uh, 2d videos or 3d videos short or long videos with license or without episode or movie videos syndication you can change search order you can enable or disable autoplay web page loads uh, you can get the detailed information about the video you can search only embeddable videos you can search video categories you can import comments from the YouTube video uh, okay let's show this to you uh, save settings let's delete our generate posts and let's run the rule again now it should take a bit longer because it is also grabbing the comments but it shouldn't take very long okay the posts are generated like we see they are the same but let's go to this again and here we have lots of comments and if we click on one name the youtube channel of the person will give you, will be given to us okay <clears throat> now i will show you the second feature the post to youtube for this to work we must enter OAuth 2 key. Go to main settings, click here again, select the test project that we just made, go to I am. Okay, so again, go to I am admin uh, API manager <coughs> credentials create credential or of client ID. You must configure first, you must give a name to your project. save and we'll create a web application we'll authorize our domain which is this here Okay, we'll set here to a temporary value. Click create. Creating. This is the key. Click here. Get them here. And insert it here. Save. Okay, now we go to this. We now must modify. Um, click done open the key and we must modify this to the value the plugin gave us click save okay now we are ready to authenticate and authorize the app click as yourself click allow and the app is authorized.
we can change settings here we can change how the post title will look we can also include some shortcodes here the post content with shortcodes we can disable automatic posting for posts or pages only internal videos this means that only videos from our server should be automatically posted uh, this feature posts videos from our post contents videos that are linked from our post contents are automatically posted also to YouTube we can automatically generate tags from video tags or categories we can select a category for the video a status a language audio language and chunks as you can leave this to its default value okay now let's test this feature to test it I'll show you my uh, channel this is my channel here will be automatically posted the video go to post add new give it a test uh, name click on add media and upload a video file that you want I'll upload this one maximum upload size wait a bit until I find another video okay I found another video that is smaller small mp4 upload it to your host and insert into post you can insert only a link what the heck ah. let's try it although in wordpress here it gives an error but let's try to upload it okay hit publish a progress bar will appear and let's go to our channel and see if the video is uploaded yes our test video is uploaded if we go to the small mp4 we see that this is the video that we were and interesting is that <coughs> this gives an error in the wordpress in the embedding but there's no problem with it in the uploading section okay let's delete this video now because we don't need it okay now I want to show you some more settings before I end this video uh, some cool features of this video you can automatically shorten URLs using Google Google Epic Key you can strip links from generated content uh, you can enable a logging feature uh, you can restrict uh, publicating the publication of the post by minimum title work count, maximum title work count minimum content, maximum content work count you can add a band word list, a required word list you can strip HTML elements from the final content you can skip posts that do not have images skip posts older than selected date automatically translate using Google Translate <coughs> so you can spin text with different methods this will add, uh, replace the words with their synonyms so the content will look new 
you can add the subscribe button to your WordPress blog. You can change the video player to fit your needs. These all are video player preferences. You can use a random sentence generator. You can include here sentences and one at random will be given if you use this shortcode in your post content. You can add add code here or you can use a render uh, an affiliate keyword replacer tool. You can search for a keyword in your content. You can replace it with another one or you can add a link to it. Also you can use shortcodes, WordPress shortcodes to include a video to embed it in your content, to search for a keyword and embed the results in your content, to search for a channel and embed the results in your content, or to search for a playlist and embed your results in your content. Finally, <coughs> we have the activity and logging. Uh, this gave me before I inserted the OR key. It's okay. So this is my plugin. I hope you will enjoy it. Give your opinion about it to me. And see you until next time. Bye-bye.